boxing is hard, man. It's hard. Like, I, I've been boxing for like 13 years, just sparring, just messing around. I mess around with Emmanuel Stewart. Oh, and he's he the best. Yeah. He's the best. Yeah, man. And all the champions back then. Yeah. The Kronk Jim was, was just so fucking. Uh, just, man, everybody was coming down here to see the fighters and stuff. Yeah. Emmanuel Lewis had all the celebrities coming down here. He, oh, he was the man back then. Yeah, man. Yeah, he was such a nice dude, and he would come over. He'd come over to my house, and we'd spar like twice a week. He'd bring his boxers from the Crunk Gym. Ooh. I know and, uh, Ricky Womack. Yeah, they were really great fighters. Yeah, that, yeah, this was... I remember the amateur when we were fighting for the Olympics. Those guys were really great fighters. Yeah. Yeah, man, and, and Emmanuel was like, he would... This was like 12, 13 years ago, right? So he would he would come over. He would show me the basics. And it took a lot for me to look. It took a long fucking time for me to just learn the basics, right? So then he started, like, a, after a couple months of us doing it. And they were just, like, you know, up-and-coming kids and stuff. Like, they would, you know, and just, you want to spar with them. And they're like, okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So <clears throat> I got a funny little story. So he's bringing his boxers. And this is, we're probably, like, six months in. And he's bringing his boxers, like, every week, right? And I'm getting my ass whipped, but I'm... At least I'm staying with him, right? I'm getting some good hits exactly. in. I feel a little yeah. bit good about myself. So one day, he comes over, and he brings his boxer from Crunk. And I'm in the house, and I remember, like, I was on the phone or something. So when I came out, the dude that he brought had his headgear on, right? And, uh, <clears throat> and I'm like, oh, okay, I guess he's ready. So I put my strap on my headgear, and we're going at it, and he kicked the shit out of me. <laughs> Fuck me up. <laughs> so after we're done, we go like three rounds, right? I don't think I got one hit in. After three rounds, he takes off his fucking headgear. And I said, man, how old are you? He said, 14. <laughs> I was like, man, I fucking quit. <laughs> I'm done. 